Hi everybody, I'm Jazzy Dance Ray Live from New York City. Yeah, how it's good? Okay, let's dive into Learn from Incredible Jazz Guitarist Wes Montgomery, Wes Leaks. Yeah, now you know that today the lyric is very, very crazy, very, very rocket man. Yeah, like that. I don't know the English anyway. Very crazy sound. So, how it works, how to think, in, how to play in the guitar, how to see the fingerboard. I explained little by little. So, after watching this video, let's turn to your play. Okay, first time I'm doing the three points for the practice leaks. The first is chord portion, second is the chord tone, third is the scale. How to use those leaks? Let's do next in analyzation. Okay, before practice leaks, we should prepare. What is that? Yeah, please play chord progression first. This is very important. Yeah, play the chord progression, you often do it. Yeah, it might be little different points, so let's figure out. Then, this is very important skill in jazz music. Easy to say, you can respond to change. This is very important in jazz music. If you're interested about it, please what I brought before, how to practice the leaks. Yeah, I tell in the detail the video, I tell in the deeply. So, if you're interested, please watch it. Then, this video, I explain very easy. So, after watching this video, please check it. Then, to play chord progression, what is that? No, memorize this form, okay? To play chord progression means So, you have to input this chord sound. Then, play the licks on it. This is very important. So after take used to do, it's easy to transfer the key or different key you don't know, right? But you can easy to figure out. Now I just do a little extra because somebody interested about to come in, please enjoy to practice like this. Then anything okay, of course swing force, no problem. One, two, three, four, 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 one. No problem. Please input this chord sound in your head. Then play the licks on it. Okay, thank you for waiting. Let's analyze the leaks. Then you remember the three points. Yeah, the one it have the scale, right? Which scale we using? Yeah, we using the mode scale. If you don't know about mode scale, please watch. I heard before about the mode scale. I tell in the detail the video. So this video, of course, are extremely easy. No problem. So after watch this video, please check it. Okay, the first is the chord position. Yeah, how to figure out chord position? You don't have the same no different strings. It's complicated. Yeah, like this. It can play a lot of uh, same stuff, right? Even different octave. So, how to figure out? Any position is okay. But basically, guitar this take you to the sixth and the fifth string position, right? So, please figure out around here. Then. Uh, one more, if you have the around this uh, center, it's much better, but this one, G minor, is, yeah, edge. <laughs> so, anyway, please today do the, this fifth string portion. Yeah, chord portion. Okay, let's the chord tone. 1, 3, 5, 10, 1, 3, 5, 10, 1. Yeah. Then, uh, G Dorian scale. Yeah. Now finish the three point. Okay, then to the leaks. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Okay, then first is this note. Why like this? One, two, three, four, five, six, six, thirteen. Thirteen to seven. Six, seven. Then after five fifths, then minor chord, first. So extra is thirteen, right? Then after it's just quarter tone. After scale, one, two, three, four. Yeah, it's very simple, but it's very sound. Uh, G minor, right? Yeah, like this motion. Yeah, like this. So, this two minor is very sound. Uh, G minor, then, yeah, up, scale up to connect to 
something. Okay, let's do the next something. Uh, C7 section, right? Okay, then C7 chord position here. Yeah. So, yeah, octava. Okay. Then chord tone 1, 3, 5, 7, 1, 3, 5, 7. Then scale is C mixolydian. Oh, one more. Yeah, too high position. <laughs> anyway, okay, let's do one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Until here, right? Okay. Wow. But this note. One, two, then half step down, flat nice. Then flat nine, third, uh, six, thirteen, then flat nine, uh, uh, major third, then flat nine, uh, major third, and six, flat nine, uh, major third, then thirteen. Yeah, very beautiful line. So basically, flat nine, this is an old side turn, right? After is a very regular one third third and 13 13 why sound this crazy okay let's move here to five right then try to substitution okay right okay let me count one minor third mm -hmm. flat 13 flat 13 okay then this one is the first then a uh, minor third flat 13 yeah why well, you can use the flat 13 okay let me count from uh, seventh g flat seventh major third minor third mm -hmm. but think it this one is just regular 13 no problem to use yeah yeah like that <laughs> then this one is basically only three notes right one third five like that same like regular like this i said open chord one three five it's not the same but so that why it's very beautiful the simple and then sound very strong right so that why sound like that basically now you know that about the theory right so try to substitution i did from 13 or minor third like that but more simple then think the c is just half step down here then a so that why it's very beautiful sound Okay, this is a point for the, this dominant. Then after I go back to fifth. Okay, let's do the tonic. Here, this position. Right? Okay, chord tone. 1, 3, 5, 7, 1, 3, 5, 7, 1. Then, I'll scale F Ionian, just F major scale. Yeah. Okay, let's do the leaks. Then start with the major seconds, first, six, eleventh, right? Then fifth, major seventh, first, eleventh, third. Yeah, finally comfortable. This is point is not direct to go to the tonic, right? Go somewhere, somewhere, then go back to comfort like that. So let me move the different position. Okay, let's play here. Okay. Yeah, he play like this, but on the end. What I do? Yeah, just two five again. 
basically starts for like this motion. This means, yeah, same like that makes two five. No finish yet. Finish. Right? Start with dominant, dominant, this motion. So this lick sound, dominant is very sound crazy, right? So that's why, uh, let's try again. Yeah, go back. So Viva Play have a lot of like this technique, so please enjoy to play. <laughs> no go direct to home. Yeah, different, different, go to bar, the shopping, whatever, like that. Then go back to home. Then analyzation is this easy. But please don't stop yet. Why is that? Yeah, you just play only one form, right? One position. At least six and fifth strings you should play. Yeah, like this. Please uh, use the three point like this before we do. So this leaks is really long, right? So it cannot straight the octave, right? So then I just play different position. Then go down. So you can play around here if you go down. And high position too. Go down. So you can customize, then you can play a lot of different position. Okay, now you different position, right? Please don't stop yet. Why? So you have to do different key. Yeah, for ear training. I don't say do the 12 key. Yeah, I don't say. Just even different one key is okay. Yeah, now I just do C. So two five E is that D minor G seven C. So so basically like this difficult leaks you should go back to C. C is the basic key, right? So you can figure out some different hint. Okay, last time I played the two chorus improvisation. First is I played randomly they connect to these leaks. Okay, please play your legs to connect to West Montgomery. Then upside down the West Montgomery to do your legs. So if you practice like this, it's easy to play in jump session with your gig. Okay, today this is. Please enjoy to practice like this and enjoy jazz guitar life together. Okay, thank you for watching until then. I hope we meet different video too. Okay, thank you very much. See you next time. Bye.